it's dangerous but nice, everyone keeps saying. Alright, let's find Torty, see if we can Get square back. away a reason you guys are out there so she doesn't blow this up in your face. That's... Fuck, Kyla, I could be dead tomorrow, let's be perfectly fair with how dangerously I've danced the line. It's Sarah I'm trying to keep out of this. Fair enough. Either way. Come on. I'll, uh... You should probably split I'll up. I'll check the marketplace if you check the docks. Yep. Dredge. Yeah. Seen Toti around recently? You're not gonna like what I'm about to say. Go on. Inquisitor dragged her off near the sea. Fuck. Having some private talk, I couldn't get close enough to overhear it. Yeah, we were trying to get to her before he did. Thanks. I don't need any Certainly am, love. <laughs> Where are we heading? No, 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 I didn't. Hmm. I don't have more information about that one, can I? I'm not too fussed about it. No, no, no. Good job. Sorry. Lighthouse, not over here. A lot harder to sneak up on them. I see. <clears throat> not much we can do now, unfortunately. Uh, if I had not known that he was going to try to talk to her, I would have dragged her away. Yeah. Well. I'm not here. Uh. Apparently, he already got to her. They're over by the lighthouse. Fuck. Yeah. Oh. Fuck. Well, there's one of two ways this can go. He finds out that I'm lying, and that just comes back on me. Really, which is are youthful. I'll deal with it. As long as he doesn't know, he only saw me, and he saw a don't big, wide, red-eyed drow beside me. That's it. What, you don't he did not that. see Sarah. I what bugged him about it, and he seemed really irritated at the fact that I wasn't giving him whoever the. Do we just need to get you a massage was. today? Do we need to get you by Sunny or the others today? I need to interact with Sarah tonight. We're doing something else. I will no, warn her if nothing comes of this right away. Okay, you actually said no. Understood. And when Dory gets back, I'll Soon. talk to her and see what she said. That Look. way I can at least warn her. Whatever happened last night, I that seems like your guys' business. Yeah. I don't need to know. 
any of it. I was just not us. They asked me to come. I owe Sarah a lot, so I went. Well, I was intending to go down I'm not trying to fuck anything up, but if there's anything that you need to tell me so I can avoid not slipping up in front of him, that could be kind of helpful. I don't need, I don't need huge detail, but he... I mean, I guess you don't want people knowing what the fuck was going on out there. I do, just you know. Oh, no, you yeah. Don't. You just say you were delivering a letter to the refugee camp. That would work. The refugee camp? Okay. That's where you were going. We did go there. Exactly. We're blood over there now. And that would corroborate with reports yeah. of those refugees who saw what they saw. Tend to stare True. longingly into the horizon, tavern keeper. Oh. The man needs to think, Sounds needs good. To focus on Do that. And tune all else else. Yeah. Nature. Hmm. I suppose we can agree on that. Truth be told, I would be doing this down by the lighthouse because that's usually where it tends to go, not even the lighthouse keeper. But I see that I probably be interrupting something and I'd prefer to not do it. Yes. Seems like you would. By the way, uh, that uh, barrel work out all right for you? Perfectly fine. Needed every yeah. ounce of it, mostly. Well, I'm good. Simply come back if you wish to sample again. Something you need, lo young lord? Just stopping by, seeing how the two of you are doing. Figured I'd uh, ask about that meeting sure. earlier. If I miss anything important. What have you been told? Nothing yet, I haven't interacted. Only that it was frustrating. Frustrating, yes. Relevant, very. Very well. Let's go speak then, young Gazing lord. at the sunset, are we? It is quite beautiful. Apparently people are attracted to my bald head. I don't know what it is. It's the shininess, I'm assuming. Tell her to find me when she's done. Certainly. Anyway, uh, the soldier. Anything I can do for you? <clears throat> no, nothing at all. I was just doing what we did. Fifteen days. Until? That's what he's getting here. I just happened to see, uh, what's the community is here. I just wanted to check something. How do you know this? Continue on, Lieutenant. Move you in a bit. Very well, sir. Having friends in high places serves well. He being... You needn't worry about that. The information is solid. No, I mean, until he gets here, you mean he being... Another one of them. The man who's hunting your father, yes. Fantastic. <laughs> yes. It seems, due to Lord Erdhard's sudden emergence as a Grodian noble, it has pulled him from quelling the revolutions in Astagon. We figured that And he out. has decided to bring himself and possibly a small retinue all the way down here. Kind of stepping on your High Inquisitor's toes, isn't it? Victor is a well-renowned Inquisitor within the Inquisitorium. Whatever he sees fit done, they will let him do. How so it matters not. Masked friend feel about this, though. He has his tasks. He has his own objectives. He will not interfere with Victor. That I can be very certain of. And you? Victor will use every avenue possible to ensure that you, Lord Erdhardt, and anyone who's aiding him are dead. My troops, mercenaries, robber barons, men, red dogs, doesn't matter. 
I go to the ends of the earth to get them killed. My proposal still stands. I want the son of a bitch dead. But, as begrudgingly as it is, I have to agree with Erdar that phasing him up front is not a good idea. Mm. We can't just throw everything we have at the wall at him and hope he breaks. No, I've done that a few times. Yes. I have the thing outside the box, but me and him cannot prepare in the slightest. We're trying to think of every avenue possible, but with the war in our minds, we're a bit distracted. Hmm. Fuck's sake, that's the last thing we needed. Yes, and when he gets here, you'll bet your ass that every Imperial man will bend the knee to him if they need it. Some of the troopers are. Loyal to other means, but the majority of them fail to the Emperor. And the ideals of Theosia. <clears throat> See if you can pick out the people that are more inclined to follow you. My entire command staff is nothing but loyalists to Theosia and the Empire's ideals. Great. Clinic staff, all of them. Not a single one of them says a crack. What about Sanders? Sanders is a man of his country, but he's easily swayed. He I've is. seen it. Right, I think but I don't know. think sending him would be a good idea. Yes, do. Anything you think of. Of course, bring it to me or your father. If we can work something out, that probably benefits everyone, actually. I will state, though, if he's not dealt with here, he will follow you all the way back home. Yeah. It is probably easier. He's hoping. He's a good man, that Inquisitor. Believe it or not. I keep hearing people say that. Well, maybe not in those words, but he's kind at least. Not like the other Inquisitors. He's, he still has his mind with him. He doesn't crack like the rest of them. You ever seen what's behind the mask? Plenty. Does it match the voice? Now you're asking too many questions. Oh, forgive me. Hmm. Was it Major, you're not up to no good here with a drow, are you? Discussing war plans. <laughs> so you I'm are up to no good. Of the weeds. Of course. Said in jest, boy. <laughs> well, if we can handle the robber baron's men, then it would I... be good. Hmm. Robber baron is no fool. That much is clear. He stored at my major, the Redard's lord. Man's had time to prepare, and the people that were facing him before were careless. So I wouldn't give for a hundred cataphracts in an open field. <clears throat> Wishful thinking. I won't impose any more. If only. Get rid of him. No, you're not. Please, by hmm. all means, remain. Hmm. What do you know of Imperial Cataphracts? Heard a thing or two. Well, please, enlighten me. But they're pretty hard to see. Merely stop. out of curiosity. <laughs> are they? They are annoyingly armored. And their shields are massive, meant to brace against any charge. 
And even if the rider goes sailing forth, he's meant to be a projectile for the men he bowls into. It's a shit job, really, if you fall off the horse, that is. <laughs> Did you know that there was a handful of Aerolandis that went out of their way into the woods with sticks, spears, and butchered a bunch of cataphrags that one of our uh, brethren had sent forward before they were supposed to be? It was the day that Lord Godfrey was captured, four years ago. God. That was the initial Until engagement that the old Major Tolman took all of that miscredit for. <laughs> but you wouldn't believe it, fully armoured men who had dreamed their whole lives. Taken down by a number of peasants. Valor of peasants, I suppose. Well, of peasants, all specifically from Ledford. Strange, those people. Mm. You find them in all the weirdest places of the world. One day they're a slave, and the next they're a lord. Rags to riches. Rags to riches. I'm sure the story is something else. I'd like to hear it one day. Major? Told you. Yeah, figured. Good man. Take care. Uh, and you. Inquisitor. Mm, too much red. Too much red. Suppose, uh, you have something like a, a primary color, so yeah. One of a oh. When am I going to get some good help around here? Look how prominent That's, it is. Seriously. Look at the side profile. <laughs> it's a nose. It's a it's a troll nose. Yeah. The Roman nose. They don't have noses. The Roman all over the board. It's literally there, there's nothing there for a nose. I want you to think about that. No, 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 I have one. See him. <laughs> understand me. Hi. Hi. Don't have noses. Now I have it here. <clears throat> what did you tell him? Yeah. Kind of moves I, I, it, oh, he's, <laughs> he knew that we were out, or, you know, I was out there, and I was like, yep, uh -huh. he saw me. This, uh, That's pretty much just confirming things, you already know, as always. No. Come with me. Yes. I'm alright. Keep moving. That would serve as kind of like a bookend. Okay. I'll be back later, girl. Love you. I see. Sorry for pressing such a hard question. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, first of all, did you give names? Did you say any names? No, I did not give names, except for the fact he was like, did the red hair girl w was with you? And I was like, oh, fuck, he saw us. So I was like, yeah, and he's like, yeah, I got confirmation from her before. Well, Good he... thing you're telling the truth. And I was like, ah! He saw the two of you. He doesn't know about Sarah. That's the main thing. He knows there's a third one. He doesn't know who it is. He doesn't know who it is. <clears throat> That's the main thing Quinn was worried Thinks about. Thinks it's an elf or a drow or uh, what elf. The story... He, he told me... Oh, sorry, go ahead. The story that we're going to use, that Quinn is going to use if he comes back and asks her again, is that you and Quinn were delivering a letter to the refugee camp and got caught up in that. Because Quinn is now the courier, and she already told him that she was delivering a letter somewhere. So if he asks you again, that's what you were doing. Just crack and say you got nervous. <sighs> okay, yeah. And don't mention Because he Sarah. asked if we were delivering something, and I said no. So... <sighs> <clears throat> you can just say you were scared. He didn't know. 
told to keep the package secret or something. It's okay, this is salvageable. Okay. We were trying to get to you before he did, but we didn't make it in time. It's okay. Yeah, he kind of snuck up on us. We, I was specifically going the different route to avoid them. I turned around to talk to Venora, and then he was going down the road that I was going to go down. I was like, ah. yeah. yeah. So. Okay. But uh, he said that he was specifically trying to talk to everyone that he saw out there because he was hunting something specifically in the forest that could infect people or something. I don't remember. People have been acting differently. Yeah, Quinn, on it. Quinn filled me in. Yeah. Okay. Well, just we're trying to protect you and such. So if you ask again, just be like, look. I was scared first time, you know how inquisitors are, blah blah blah. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Mm. Uh, so, uh, so, yeah, so Sarah is all already aware that he is looking for her and everything, so okay. Good. As long as we don't give names. Uh, yep. Alright. What am I gonna do with you, Torty? What? What? Nothing. I just see you get caught up in so much shit that really... ...isn't really your shit. You, so many times people are like, stay out of trouble, and it's like, I'm fucking trying, man. You're a scally well, you I don't find you. that. Come on. <laughs> you did good. Thanks. <clears throat> I have not seen Go back to your dad if you need to. Oh yes, that's right. Thank you. I returned to town. <sighs> need something? What are you waiting for? Just looking. I was looking for your. Mm. Then but I'll let him know the other thing. simply about the maps through the forest. They are very old. I see. Ah, if I see yes. him, I'll let him know that you're looking for him. Oh, good God. <laughs> of course. What happened to you? But I hope that you are well. Uh, as well as I can be. Mm. And you? Hearing well. Good. I'm having to give more and more cards to the warrior. Well, let us know if we can help you in any way. But for now, it is just waiting and politics. I can understand if you love those. Imperial engineers. You were there. How was it sitting there? Standing there waiting. Wasn't too bad actually, it was my first real experience with a small council. Trying to learn before I jump in, you know. But more so the matter of payment is concerned. Oh, don't worry. Hold still. He's already learned. Did you have this book on you? Not for a long time. Whether you like it or not. How did you do that? Magic, my friend. Outside of perhaps politics. If orcs start pouring in those walls, mm. also, I'm sure. Sure. Do nothing. <laughs> Add it to the ledger. No. <laughs> if the robber baron's men start but pouring yes, in, you will learn quickly that it is not going to be nothing. fun. Yeah. Some of them can drag on for hours. Also, no. Yeah, I was standing. The rest of you were sitting down. My knees were like. There's a great deal of the people here <laughs> to be better off. Don't worry. That was a short session. Great. I'm mm. looking f forward so much. It will be fun. <laughs> no. I think you'll see. He's already learned enough. Now you can actually jump in. You can jump in with the sharks instead of just watch them. I don't know if I'm even on the council technically. I'm son to a lord, but I don't think I'm on the council. I'll be sure to get back to you. I can still handle you're, things for you're him. You're a noble, so you have every reason. You are a noble, so you have every reason to have a seat. Great. 
Maybe next time I'll actually have a seat. You know, if you really, really wanted one, you could have had. Mm. Some of Quinn. the tools are part of your... Sorry, I need to catch this. Yeah. Thank you, though. Maybe they can get him the Walk with me. Table. What's up? My goodness. Yeah. Managed to catch Torti. She, um, Fuck. didn't... She didn't give any names. Thankfully, he asked her if they were delivering anything. She said no, but I informed her of what the story is. So, thankfully, the person you were with is still the person you were with and not anyone specific. I'm supposed to leave him a letter tonight for my sister. I think I'm going to leave one, but just... Makes it look like a show of good faith, explaining that I went to the refugee camp, like you said. Maybe it'll look like I'm playing ball, trying to be sneaky, as it were. You know? Sure. Hopefully, maybe it'll keep him off my back. I don't know. Good time for Kay to be gone. Love this. Alright. Your business. Hmm. But I suppose, considering it can fuck all your shit up, that is what I'm going to do. If I die, I die. Just make sure that my ring gets back to Kay. Sure. For him. Not me. the metaphorical bubble that everyone is living in. You're facing one, we face them in thousands. Yeah. Mm. If there's gonna be more coming from what the violence of it, please don't walk away again, I want to talk to you! Catch him then, before he runs, catch him. <laughs> what the fuck? Where did he fucking go? <laughs> I will. I almost lost you until you peed. <laughs> you're gonna help you, Tang. Please don't. Please, please don't. I've had a, I've had a hell of a day. Hello. No. Doing anything tonight? Quick, now is your chance to run. <laughs> Depends on who you're asking. What do you need, Tang? Can you? Give me advice on throwing things. You know, you're like the third person to ask me that today. I'll say the same thing I'll say to them. I can get you started, but it'd be hard. I will talk to Sarah about it and see if she's willing. She's a lot more better at it than I am. I just need one day to get to militia trained. I... That's all! Kind of the same. Let me check my level. I don't know how good I am at throwing that. If you are at bare fucking uh, minimum trained. Yeah, I'm trained. I could do it. <laughs> Technically. You can get me to militia. I can get you to militia. How are things? Have you seen Sarah anywhere? Not for a long time. I'm <laughs> actually looking for her. God damn it. Me too. Who are you looking for? Sarah. Miss Sarah. I haven't seen her all day. She's been around. She's been. I saw her she's earlier, but it's been a while. Yeah, where is she? I'm gonna go ask Quinn. Maybe she knows where she is. Probably. See, throwing's very easy, Tang. The first thing you do is grab the thing that you want to throw. Okay, never mind. <laughs> You grab the thing Done. you want to throw. <laughs> oh, he did it first. And then you just kind of point at the th thing you want to throw it to. But then you do increase in numbers. So uh, so can I throw this barrel at you, Drake? Well, I put it down. Put it down. I don't know what that is. But in full seriousness, if it works better for you to teach with knives, I have a, I have a knife. I can do it. Um, you know what? I'm grabbing L and I'm grabbing Oshan, and we're doing some uh, dagger and sword training tomorrow. I'll come and find you as well, and we'll do some throwing. Get everyone on the same page. Okay. Find me too. I'll get the whole gang together. Down for that as well. 
And if anybody wants to learn how to punch someone in the face very effectively, come to me. <clears throat> You know what? Fuck it. Let's right, make it a day. I'll prank you. Right right I'll start strength training somebody. people so that they can wield anchors like me. <laughs> T together, everyone achieves more. Training day. More. I'm sorry, what did you say? And together, so everyone becomes right collectively right uh, garbage <laughs> at <laughs> All right. a lot of little things instead stands. of good at anything. We just teach everyone the moment to be slightly more shit. I mean, oh, hey, at that point, fuck God you damn. You can grab any weapon around. You. Said the square my stance. That's not squaring it. That's oh, Ling it. <laughs> that's some pervert shit. <laughs> oh God. The next thing you want to do is you want to. The main issue of you riding a horse is that you're too heavy, right? What you want is the main momentum. Not the fact that you're not trained in it. So pretty much forcing it forward. Uh, I've never ridden a horse, but I imagine if. And the horse could carry me, I can maybe point it in the right direction. Push it the rest of the way. <sighs> maybe. Right. I don't know. So, yeah, you're walking you just, you just grab the reins and pull, right? No. I mean, no, that's just throwing a... a punch. If you want to flurl flurry, or get a combo, there's nowhere to strike back. Oh, he's a breed of horse and hang off the good. I want to learn how to juggle people. What we need is like a bear. All right, well, first Would you, you ride a bear into battle? Dash. I think you're more. <laughs> I've never tried to bears up with a bear or not well, just attack me. If you want to learn mm -hmm. how to punch somebody, you either talk to me or your wife. I mean. Yeah, I feel like an ox right. would be easier. There was that one thing that. <laughs> Marco had that could bend any beast to build to your own, but. I'm able to teach you Japanese. I'm not able to teach you. <sighs> If, uh, I'm not even gonna ask what the fuck the you're, the weird, the weird crazy shit punch. you're saying. Go ahead. <sighs> Some fucking weird item. Nonsense. I've been parried. I'm now in stun lock. <sighs> Nonsense, indeed. Do you think it could be the, the, uh, the rubber band? The humans bleed, caretaker. They will die if one does not aid them. Avenger? We can go to Bolano and then up through Bolano, just follow the coast up that way. Oh, That'd shit. be safer. Uh, Tori is talking to um, Bolano now in the back room of the hotel. Oh, shit. I would be more in I am the yeah. I'm going to be retiring for the evening, I think, because there's less business that I have to take care of now. Uh, uh, All right, I'll be right back.
Skyler, you up here? Little lordling. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, my menu works now. Holy shit, my menu works. I'm sure it's just because I'm inside. Oh, it broke again. Well, that was fun while it lasted. Damn it! It's gonna fucking crush me. <laughs> For a brief shining moment. Oh, for fuck's sake, what? Hello? Mm. Stop opening the menu, you stupid head. What the f- Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking scream.
fuck's sake. I love my job, I love my job, I love my job, I love my job. <laughs> oh, it's a marvel of technology. Lovely job. I do. I just. <laughs> God, VR, man. Most wonderfully frustrating shit. Where are you running off to? Gonna go kill the brewer. Uh, good luck, then. Do you know how Miss Leona would have been so upset and crying if you had died going there? Why did you do that? Same reason anyone did. Needing money. This way. Leave you to your devices. It's fine. Here's the right. information. Where's Dredge? Have a good time. He was here when I left him. Thanks. I'll see you later. See you. I saw him down that way. Can you bring him to me, please? Sure. Just tell him it's time. Oh, okay. this together. oh there he is. Never mind. Come on, Dredge. Is she going to become a problem? You'll be the first one to know if she does. Usually I'm the last one to know. <laughs> well, I wasn't close to her last time. I was trying to kill her. <clears throat> I'm... The company she's been in has been very concerning. Yeah, I'm dipping yeah, my toe well, in it. I'm handling it. Yeah, me too. 
Yes, well, I'm not worried about you spilling what you know to save your own skin. Well, too little too late. Torty is young. I'm afraid since he got oh. her alone, she could have said something that would conflict with what Quinn said. No, I've handled that, and it's fine. I trust you. Yeah. Come I'm going on. to be keeping my head low and away from him as much as I can. If I have to... He can't do anything I'll to talk to him. I know, but... Who knows what his goals are? Confront him. You're smart enough. You know how to hold your tongue. Play his game. And if someone has to pull your ass out of the fire, I will. You cannot touch me. We'll have to adjust our story then. That's up to you. If Should you... I even ask story? What story? <sighs> Is this me finding out about something last again? <clears throat> No, I was going to tell you. I was supposed to be handling something last night involving uh, the refugee camp and dread knives. Sarah, Torty, and Quinn went in my stead. Quinn? I know. What? Yeah, I know. I've already talked to them about it. Point is, the Inquisitor caught them on the way there. He was out there doing his own nefarious shit, and he was curious as to why they were there. He talked to Quinn first, she came out to me. Out there? Wait, what do you mean, out there? In the woods. There's no jurisdiction to be out anywhere. Yeah, well. He's Doing investigating what? the woods. I don't... Killing unmarked no elves, apparently. Jurisdiction. Apparently, he's investigating a string of <clears throat> all kinds of different types of unmarked people who have been acting erratically as if controlled by something. He's Even if that something. was the case, he has no permission from the Redolt dynasty to do as such. That's them overstepping. That's got to be reeled in and confronted. Well, the only people that saw him out there were those three, so if that happens, we'll know that one of them talked. And it's simple. Two of them just have to be put under protection. <clears throat> well, he doesn't even know Sarah was there, so she's already protected. <sighs> Until someone runs them off. The only person that could do that would be Torty or Quinn. He... He is the only reason why Torty is alive right now. What do you mean? The mission... It went very wrong at the end, I'm not going to lie. We succeeded in getting our target, but Torty took the brunt of the damage, Quinn close behind. I was unscathed because I was built for things like this. Bringing those two was a mistake. Torty, there was something wrong with her. She wasn't responding well to the treatment that I was administering. I'm not a professional, but even then it was really bad. She just kept throwing up blood. <coughs> uh, we were at the crossed keys and we showed up. Stuck her with some giant fucking needle. Fucking put her blood in some contraption and then made her drink it. She vomited up this black bile. Sounds like a blood and test. Said she'd be fine. The very same thing Soma has. Free of charge. And he didn't ask questions either. Not yet, at least. Until today. They have their Spoke reasons. Soon. Make you indebted to them so they can call upon you later. The fact that this Inquisitor has not been overt shows that they are incredibly dangerous. They're getting people to like them, accept them. They know what they're doing. Mm. They're doing a damn good job of it. 
I've allowed a lot of these operations that you've spoken to me about, my son, to go under the radar. I haven't asked questions, but I'm going to have to start asking questions now. But there's an inquisitor involved. Hmm. We'll be talking about that later. Now's not the time. This is where we stand. At this current point in time, there has been nothing but non-stop skirmishing between the Allied forces we have here and the Robber Baron's men. He has been utilizing cavalry, but not in a melee fashion. His men have become extremely good at firing crossbows off of their backs. Hit and run tactics. They come near, let off a volley, and fall back repetitively. They've cut down at least 40 men in the past hour. And the Imperial Night Killers have not been able to pick them off because they're slow to reload. They have the advantage in every way unless we start digging ourselves in, which might become the next thing we have to do if they push as far as the cross keys. The next few days, the Major and I are going to start an offensive. We're going to try and draw them into the old battlefield. We're going to use a false retreat to try and dry out their cavalry to feign running us down. The plan is to have both halberdiers and night killers in shallow ditches dug out the night prior laying prone. As soon as we go to fall back and run past their position, they will rise up. The halberds will make short work of horse and rider. And the initial wave should be broken by the night killers about to crash against the line. Lady Hella swing by, uh, mentioning something about maps just on that. Hi. Now. We're in a precarious situation where even with that plan, if they have cavalry in reserve and decide to hit our line a second time while the night killers are reloading, they will break our line. They have more than enough horsemen to do it unless you are successful tonight. This is the order of operation. You will be leaving on foot unseen, heading to tell or keep. You will have to cross the battlefield, stop for nothing, for anyone. Do not help in any engagements. Do not help the wounded. Leave that to the medics that are there. And do not get involved in any of the fighting. Skirt around it if you can. Avoid it if you can. There shouldn't be any fighting now that it's late, but it's likely that there was a recent skirmish from what I've been told. There will be patrols. Avoid them, but do not go too far off the beaten path of the roads. There's orcs about. They came near Cassetto again, but they didn't try to get near it thanks to the garrison. Don't need any extra complications. They're probably drawn in by all the fighting and blood. The real challenge is when you reach Tellor Keep, there is now a palisade that has been erected around the outside of the castle and its walls. Inside are various tents and standing areas for the infantry that is most valuable to the robber baron. His shock troops reside here. It is imperative you do not get their attention, because if you do, you will be surrounded and there will be no way out. Maintain your secrecy, and that will not be an issue. More than likely, you will either have to try and find a way to climb over the walls. I highly doubt, with the increased security, that you're going to be able to get through the bottom floor of the castle. You're in for a climb. Climb to the top of the keep. Find an entry point, and push in. Your objectives are to find whatever information that you can that will aid us in our fight against the robber baron. Troop movements, troop deployments, cavalry, ranged, anything that they have, where they've put it and why. We need that information. Any maps, 
documents. We don't want any hostages or people trying to get someone out of that situation will be nigh impossible unless they can fight with you. That brings me to the last part of it. Sir Richard Exter, according to the Major, has found himself into one of the cells there. He is thought of as a Imperial uh, extension because of his hand in helping reveal the radicalists inside of the embassy. The robber Baron and his men have him in one of the cells there, along with several other low-profile prisoners. Try to get him out. If it seems untenable, I've already made that clear. Your primary objective is the cavalry. Release the horses, scare them so they run out of the palisade and burn the barn to the ground. That is your primary. Everything else is secondary, as per the barons. But I want every possible effort to be made to retrieve this knight. You have questions? I'm good. I have a health potion for you, Sarah. Tier two. Thank you. Mm. The two of those are from Dredge. Can thank him. <laughs> thank you, Dredge. Any questions from Do you, Dredge? It? Do we know at all what the castle looks like? Shape. How to say the fit? Any spaces, ways to sneak in? One of you have been there before. Does roof access? The interior, mm. I'm sure I will remember it more when we get there. But I think it's about three stories. Maybe From the way four. that Sarah had explained it to me, there are three stories, as she just said. Offices on the second and third. Cells on the first. Something like that. Is that correct? I think so. I have that grappling hook you wanted to make. You'll be able to plan when you arrive. Mm. That should get us up, Perfect. hopefully. I'm going to need it to get up there. Yeah. <clears throat> Without it, I can't really climb. You can, though. That's why I gave uh, you that. That's through the potion that one of you is going to have to carry along the way. I'm going to be bringing, like I said to you, a dose of one of the medicines in case I go. Um, probably give that to Sarah. It's She's a better thrower. Perfect. It has to... Well, I'm keeping it on me. I see. It's my get up. It's my escape guarantee. If everything goes to shit, it can knock out everyone around me who breathes that stuff in, so, like I said to you, we need a way to... He's handing you the climbing potion. <laughs> way for me to warn you two in case I need to use it so you two don't get knocked out. Pick a word, any word. Just can't be something the uh, guards at the keep or castle will know. Means they shouldn't breathe it in either. Thunder. Just say thunder. Got it. If I say thunder, both of you, hold your breath, close your eyes. Right. And wait for the sound of bodies hitting the floor. And that's all. worth it. Bernard told me it is very hard to make those. <clears throat> Let's hope we won't need to use it. He seems to be able to get a consistent supply. I'm gonna bring my health potion and, I guess, some fusing powder just in case. Did you ever get your tools replaced? I did. Good. 
Undoubtedly, you'll need them. Yeah. Let me make something very clear. If he gets captured, and they identify who he is, we're going to have a hostage situation. And I'm going to be hamstrung. And I will do everything that I have to to get you back. Do not put me in that position. Understood. Good. Now get your shit together and get out of here. It'll be very dark soon. You have ways of hiding One identity. Finger. I recommend it. Yeah. I'm gonna change upstairs. I'll meet you by the gate. If I could also do the same. Knowles just wanted to know when I was leaving, so if you could pass that message to her. I shall. I'll head to the keep as soon as you leave. Grazie. I'm also not going to have uh, any weapons as big as I'm used to until we get there, and honestly, if I have to pick something up that big, we're already caught. Correct. So. So at least do you know what your stuff is, Stretch, and you'll have more work like this, I'm sure. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not too out of practice. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully. How are things Just the hoping walls? that rope won't snap. Walls are going good. It's, I hit a couple snags. That wall by the farm, the foundation <laughs> below it is... Middling to crap at best. <clears throat> entirely bring it down and completely rewall it. It's gonna take more stone, which means it's gonna take a hell of a long, lot longer. I have 50 units. Can I crossbow this to me? Uh, yeah, I'm renting one from units. the. What's it called? I can get another zero. And I got more, um. um bolts too. Good so boy, nice. I can promise. 50 every 5 days. 50 Super every 5 more. days. Carano apparently was a success. Some of those soldiers... Feeling alright? Nice! <laughs> That's good. Uh, three did not. Um... Two soldiers. Yeah, I just got some news that I'm processing. Right. It's a lot. A story about that. <laughs> Jesus, fuck! Oh my fucking god. Sorry for them. <laughs> um... Took up my oh, big ass that. ladder if you need it. <laughs> Hopefully not. <laughs> oh, let's now, go. Right. You know, Dredge, if I ever see something like that coming down an alley to me, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna, gonna cry. Rolling my sword to the <laughs> end. You if you jump, jump scare me, look at my, look at me, look at my sassy oh, finger. God. If you jump scare me, I will fucking cry, oh. and I will get all of us Besides killed. All that, you understand? What are your orders? <clears throat> all right. Let's, let's go. go. Stand by in case a rescue force is needed. All right. No, 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 no. Don't go that way. Why? Because there might be traps on the ground. No, that's just behind fucking Marcus's shop. I go out of this one like at least three times a day. Okay, good. Plus, people are fucking working Traumatized. here. If they put fucking traps here, I'm that'd be stupid. Ah, ah! Oh no, bear trap! I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Let's go. Stop! <sighs> yeah, shit, I haven't unlocked Dredge yet. <laughs> I do. I suppose it makes sense that you know it. I'll translate for Sarah. About you. All right. Huh? What happened? There is a wordless language things. that me and Greeks can use to stay quiet. 
Oh, that thing where he draws symbols and stuff. Yeah, he's showed me a few of them, but not enough where I'm confident to read it by myself. There's a whole hand signal thing too. Hand signal. Hmm. No speak, unspoken. Like that. <clears throat> this is going to be an interesting one. Here, I'll show you the most important one for tonight. Alt. Stop. Go. Dredge, can you see in the night time? No, and I just learned today that there are potions to fix that, but no one in town is able to make them, or those that have them will not part with them. Amazing. I can navigate well enough at night. Yeah. It's not that hard to see in the dark. Just still pitch black unless I watch for all the little reflections. Well, once we get on behind the palisade, I'm sure there'll be plenty of lights to navigate by. Mm. Alright, we'll continue on the road until we get just past the cross keys and then we'll break to the right. Or left. I've only been up this way that far once. We'll need to cross the bridge first. Only Correct. The time I went up by the keep, I jumped by Robert Baron's men. Let's hope that doesn't happen this Not, time. Uh, great. Yeah. There's an ambush point they like to use between uh, two cliff faces. Rocks. Mm, I know the place. We'll uh, avoid that like the fucking plague. Good. There's if really probably there. we hang to the left, it's more forest. Oh, towards the right is that open field. Uh, oh boy. Uh, luckily the moon, I can see the stones of the road. <clears throat> and now we get to... Uh, Racial speed boost. <laughs> Remember that I'm not as fast as most people. What a still night. Leaving dread in the dust. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> I forget how fast we are sometimes. <laughs> Man, I'm not even going full stick. How do you get a speed boost at night? <laughs> right. He's very slow. Poor guy. <clears throat>
that's on the bridge. Mm, I see. so cute he's like running at full speed We've been fighting all fucking day. These robber baron bastards have been on us all fucking night. hear the movement of men nearby. You've passed the safe zone of the Radon soldiers, and this is entirely now the robber baron's territory. You can hear distant night killer fire off to your left as skirmishing takes place in the woods in the dark of night. Little flares of light in the distance.
possibly. I don't want to shout out to them. As you start to move forward, Kyler, you glance to your far right and notice that the Romber Baron has stationed men on top of the hill you just passed on your right side. They'd be able to see torchlights for God's knows how far. A little nightly exercise, what's wrong with that? Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. I mean, honestly, it's gonna mess with us down here. <laughs> uh, only an idiot. Only an idiot. You're telling me? Huh? Are they you know what it feels like to be shot by one of those fucking things? No, and I don't. I don't think, think, think I want to. Calm down. I'm not. I don't know intention huh. to take a night killer down to the chest, man. I don't think anybody here does. Well, I mean, no one said necessarily to the chest. You can like take one to the fort and you'd be probably fine. You guys ready for the offensive tomorrow? As ready <laughs> as I can be. Get in it. Got my blade sharpened for it. Yeah. Plan is simple. Draw out the leaders and grab them. Huh? Good one, huh? Take it easy. Write yeah, that shit down, chat. <clears throat> They'll come out willingly.
don't know where Dredge is. Yeah, I don't know either. <clears throat> no idea. He is really hard to spot. Fuck. Alright, well, what do you think is the best avenue here? Do we go around to the right, along the cliff face, or hope there's a break in the ga gap to the left? Hmm. Maybe to the right. Okay. Where the fuck did he go? I don't see him. Gonna go around to the right. Sorry. Two guards get two guards side. Unseen right. Right. Hi. Over. So large, room so quiet. You know Cliff. what Dredge's pass line for it. It's not in totality. But for this Northman or Bjorning or whatever you want to call it. He could very well serve this purpose. Some tools just need the right hand by. Apparently there's no guards to the right. Good. Wait, patrol. See. Continue to make your way along the palisade, following it, keeping an expert eye to the ground and to the wood. You come to the very edge, and look at that. It seems it doesn't quite meet the rock face, and there's a bit of a ditch down into the area in front. A whole unwatched section of wall. the horses. Mm. This would be our exfil. We'll do the horses, then move up here. Now we gotta get into the keep.
Call me. As you all come to this jagged hole in the palisade, you've all done this before, whether it's your time in Coricatus, your time with a gang, or your time sneaking about and slitting throats. For the natural 20, all three of you are silent as the knights that hid your approach. Alright. <clears throat> what do you think about one of us taking that climbing potion, getting over the wall? Securing the grappling hook and lowering the rope. Do you want to do the honors? A quick interjection. I forgot to ask you to get climb all. Do that now and teleport to me. <clears throat> oh, my knees! <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Dude, I gave up on crouching. Yeah, I can tell. My knees. <laughs> My knees. Just uh, rich need hope. Click the NPC. And then you do the climb all. Hold on. Climb into heaven now. Goodbye. As soon as you return, your cards are up. <clears throat> well, treasure is your potion. Up to you. Think I won't need drink it. I climb, I lower rope. You climb rope. Or you climb, you lower rope. Potion. Is your rope and hook? This will be interesting to see. Agreed. Finding yourself eventually on the wall itself. I'll get you last. You're good, horse. I just wonder what yours name is. Very young. So I got an offer on the note here. Just trying to find what I grab. Forget about you. Yeah, such a sweet thing. Yes, you are. <laughs> you worry. I got you. Just use the crenellation. <laughs> don't don't yeah, try to grab the crenellation. <laughs> I'm grabbing it right now. <laughs> I'm grabbing it right now. Huh? Figured it out. I have to do this blind. As you make your way up here, Dredge, you do it carefully, and you tie the rope around one of the crenellations, 
and lower it down, giving a plus two to both your allies. However, when you came up here, there was a slight crunch. Some of the stone here is worn. And you see one of the guards talking at the entrance whip their head in this direction. With a seven, they heard something. After you. <laughs> Up I go. Let's get closer. And closer. George is picking up a small stone. Okay. George is picking up a small stone, tossing it over the shoulder of the guard into the small wall. <laughs> Behind him. With a 15, it'll work. Your head will whip around. Uncertain. And you're going to go check the bottom of that tower, guard. A quick brush. Oh. Seraph with a 7 plus 2 and Kyler with a 6 plus 2, you'll be able to make your way up here. Sound would have attracted the guard, but he's now too far away. What's the best way to get to the rope? We still have to get on the roof. Yeah, we're not going to go through the bottom floors. Mm. We're not going to be able to get Make into the front way. doors. No. Onto the walls together, starting to look at the situation around you. It is... Heavy security. The robber baron doesn't play around. That much is clear, but you are unseen, and no one yet knows of your presence. I know there's a door on the roof. How do we get Goes down to... You gotta climb. Lead the way. Take the grapple. She says I He's got it. Your heart plummets a little bit. Not so much because you're afraid of it. But god damn, that is a fall. You know that It'll if be you fun. get near the top and you fall, likely you'll break or die. You must be careful. I won't let you fall, don't worry. Thanks. Lead the way. It's in our nature. Um... I want to avoid the light. Footsteps can be heard coming. Hey, hey. Protect that what? protect that lantern. Fine. You complaining about your night shift? Oh, here we go again. I don't want to hear that again, or you're going to get double duty. Dad! Dad! Hey! Hey! <laughs> Do you see this? Yes. Uh, no, no, it, no, no. There's some points that are misplaced here. It looks like... Look. Look, so, if this is left as it is, someone could, someone could maybe try and climb their way up. We need to get... 
Hey, did you, uh... Need someone uh, to come in and put the some guy we brought in? Some kind of feeling. Make sure we'll climb on. Oh, he fucking, uh... Yeah. He's a nice fucking... Well, I'm thinking... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, he can claim whatever the fuck he wants to be. He doesn't look like a knight to me. Oh. I mean, like, come on. What kind of knight wears rags like that? Does anyone do it for punishments? He wouldn't think that. Let's steal on him than we do. Yeah, so I need climb the wall. I'm thinking about how to spell you know, this. Stroke their ego like that. Alright. Ah, right. Rough ideas. People think just because they have uh, armor it makes them a knight or some shit. Uh. Like, well, I don't think we know many masons, do we? Because he has the word mm, sir, but really. his name is a knight. <laughs> If there is a nation, I'm most likely to say that. from uh, out in knowledge tales, huh? <laughs> Still, I heard that. Uh, uh, I don't think it has uh, uh, any one of those. Uh, I don't think anyone's uh, gonna be as gracious uh, as that surgeon. He's been uh, trying to get information out of them. Never know. But, I'm curious. Don't know what he expects to get. Let's see if the others are to the wall. Yeah, more than likely, he's more likely to break the poor bastard. That's a good idea. Oh, if you're a uh, good steward, we could always patch him up, you know? Big butch, man. Yeah, but still, like I said, we have the Wait, umbrella. Come here. It's like, oh, sorry! I was found creeping through your garbage! Ooh. Look, there. What do you think about getting up on this? Onto the rocks? Are you eating on me, John? around. That's a sighting. I'd rather go to him out. Say again. <sighs> that building. Up. Onto the rocks. Around. What do you think? Or is it, it better work. to go around? I've never climbed this building, so it's gonna be completely new for both of us. But if I were to choose, I would take that side. Alright, let's do it. We'll need to go around. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Security is tight. <gasps> it's clear that this is a strategic point that the Robber Baron has no intention of losing. And the stationing here is clear evidence of that. Fuck.
Hey, you doing all right here, Yemen? Hmm? Are you doing all right? Yeah. Hey, go bring a torch over you the up. coming over there. Rope. He's bitching over there for a torch. Yeah. Thankfully, the stone is full of holes from a lack of upkeep. So there are plenty of handholds to grab. But with an eight, as you reach the top, you will feel the roof groan ever so slightly under your weight. The guards underneath it take notice. The hell? What was that noise? Dredge is lowering the grappling hook for those below. Understood. How was that? Huh? What? You're telling me in the tower. And I hang on, I'm checking on something. Checking on something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move on the fucking way, fatas. Oh, you start that? DM? Dredge is going to... Uh, Dredge is taking one of the shingles and mm -hmm. throwing it onto the walkway where it is dark. With a 19 dredge, it will be arced perfectly and land exactly where you wanted it to go. What was that? Middle of the arcway, by the door. Or walkway, not arcway. He's handing you the rope. With a 14 and a 17 plus 2, Sarah and Kyler, you'll be able to make your way up with ease thanks to the rope. Step on, if you step on his hand, he's boosting you up. Those torches there are quite intense. 
on top of the tower. Holy crap. Tossing down the rope. Holding on to the grappling hook. Well, as long as uh, the light stays burning, we know we're safe. Yep, we should see about getting a light on that third tower. It's all dark now. Well, if we could find the siege engineer, we would, wouldn't we? Looking around, you can see a ton of movement in the world beneath you. Robber Baron soldiers patrolling the walls, patrolling the outside. Only a couple voices from above you, but you are high. I am. I don't know. What, what are the odds? I think they can uh, get one installed over there and bring it huh, and reposition the engine. I'm still curious where he's going to put them. Surely not the There isn't really any room in Yeah, there's no room inside here. Do you think you could position one on top of the one? Maybe that's why there's a third light. Maybe Good you luck, could buddy. one on top of that wall, on top of that tower. The smaller one. Maybe a ballista? Yeah. Ballista that, that we can angle down. down? Yeah. yeah. Maybe that's why. The problem with that is... What's it? It'll be hard for us to aim it straight down. You know, not to mention how, 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 how hard it's gonna... So to carry the ammo up the stairs. Some poor sod is gonna be put on that. There isn't gonna be me. Maybe there could be a lever and pulley system. <coughs> I don't know if we have the time to. As you pull that. yourself up, Dredge, you reach towards the top at the very lip. He just slowly you pulls you away pull from underneath him. Over. We just follow the orders. The old <laughs> wall crumbles a bit in your handhold. You lose it. You flail for a second, about to drop straight down. With a oh. five, you scrape your hand down all the way, barely catching yourself at the lid, at the ridge right at the bottom before you drop down onto the tiles below. Shh. Ever so Here's close. Something? I like where that is. Hmm? Sure. I don't think I heard anything. Eh. The rock's coming loose. Yeah, the, it's the been happening these since walls. the bombardment. I mean, we did a number <laughs> on this place. <sighs> Cleaning out all the scorch marks was hard enough. I don't know how the fire <laughs> they spread inside. You heard that Maybe they, they were threw, burning the threw a man in there. They threw a man into the fire. Someone was going to be questioning, I'm sure. There's also <laughs> Carefully uh, making your way up, you avoid the rotted looking areas and are able to pull yourself up with ease. Someone, some nonsense, one of our men was spouting something about some sort of wish when we were taking this place. Looking up, you see Dredge forward. disappear. And a rope whoop, lands at your feet. <clears throat> Probably. Kyler, with a 17 plus 2, you'll go up with ease. <clears throat> it's uh, kind of surprising how easy it was actually to take this place, all things considered. <clears throat> didn't even require our regular forces, just the dime a dozen mercenaries. They yeah. fell way too quickly. Well, I mean, there wasn't much to take in the state of things before the, 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 the bombardment. Sarah, your head on the mission, hand over hand, 
over hand as you climb your way up. You've done this many times. It's in your blood. See the way ever? I've been Quiet, the patrols of sneaky. Fighting the Imperial. Perhaps even an assassin. Tell, the Whatever the reasoning. <coughs> With a is? three plus two. I hadn't seen. I hadn't seen a volley yet. As you go to move your right hand, suddenly it will not Probably broken. move. It will not budge. Probably you stifle a now. yell, a scream, and even. As you look at your line. hand, right. has no distinguished was, separation it, from the stone. All line, like all the same time. You lose the feeling in your right hand, as it seems to be almost stuck to feeling. the wall. The palm almost completely flush with the rope. Everything from the elbow down is stone. You cannot move. Thing. You struggle and struggle, and the rope seems to fray in this weird, strange sensation. Even in the dark, you can see your flesh has turned to the color of stone. You cannot move anything past your elbow. I've heard rumors that they have, a, they have. You are very stunned. You know, of their own. And the rope is fraying but every time you yank the hard the stone, pulling the at it. Probably. With a five, the rope almost cuts through. You barely probably. hang on, freezing your movement. This is the moment the feeling in your arm you know exactly gone in its are. entirety. Terrible pain at your elbow as flesh one. seems to be you. struggling with stone <laughs> itself. <laughs> Yeah. Pull her up. And then start up to do it again, and again, and again. The rope starts just begins to pulling. The metal for the Try to pull and you up, better. Sarah. And with a 14, it's they'll be able to pull you up <laughs> with relative ease. But what is your arm from the elbow down will stay gripped, solid stop. like a statue holding on. Stop, 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 stop. stop. You know that if you let go, if your body drops down, your arm will stay where, where, right where it is. Your elbow will likely break, <coughs> shatter, rip, and you will plummet. Wish I would bring some up here. Fuck. Been up here for hours. Tyler, as you peer a little farther over, completely perturbed, you see easily that the black clothing on Sarah's arm. It's the same color as the wall. In fact, everything from her elbow down isn't moving. I know, you have boy. never seen anything Ooh, like this. <laughs> and then he falls and dies. <laughs> One second. It was all for you. God, it's so easy, Sarah. Just I'm fucking do this, good. idiot. Like I'm sorry, I'm fucking <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> He's gonna hold his hand up to dredge. Your foothold, your foothold gives out, and you just catch your foot onto another bit as more old stone passes away. You know, half the time places those torches out there to distract I'm fucking stuck. I'm in the wall. I don't. She says this. You look further down. She's not lying. Part of her hand is melded with the stone. It does not move. Everything is flesh until the elbow. Go on without me. Go with Dredge and keep going. Not happening. Just. As you say this, you have Sarah, to. the stone around your arm, the stone that is your arm, cracks. A searing pain rips through your arm, almost as if you ripped your own flesh asunder. The wood and stone around your hand begins to crumble. You start to lose your grip on the wall. You start to shift down, and at the very last second, the stone crumbles away, revealing flesh underneath, all almost as if brand new, like a scab was peeled off as blood splotches from the brand new sensitive skin. You are free. <laughs> See what they have to report soon enough. I'm just looking forward to getting off this roof so I can turn in for the night. <laughs> what about you? Do you need to start? Come here. 
Fuck me. What the fuck? Looking at her hands, Kyler, you can see it looks like someone took the time to remove all the dead skin. All that is underneath is the pinkish skin, you know, that'd be hurtful to the touch, almost like a burn or something. I told you. I'm just a fucking liability. Yeah, no, it's okay. You have no fucking clue what's going on. I doubt he can even see it, right? That's a good sign for us. If they can't get into the pretty line. Indeed. Take a second. It's okay. Takes off his gloves again. Well, he takes off his left one. 